Christine Burnett and I'm an artist and also studying at the UCA in Farnham doing a master's in my just finishing my first year in fact second. I created the winning image for the competition Framing Noel. I've always been interested in portraiture and I've more or less painted most painted and drawn most of my life. I'm also very interested in um, history and working along in projects that look at history and create contemporary images just like this from, from the um, historical records to bring people up to date with um, what's happening in the houses and what's happened in the past and give the viewer a better and more connected view of, of people in the past and their lives. And it would be a great opportunity to actually create, create a um, contemporary image from the Joshua Lorenz painting. When I portrait painting myself, I always look to, to be able to convey the personality and the character in the portrait of the person. So you can get more of a view of what kind of person is there. So um, the same applies with what I was doing with this image. I really wanted to get under the skin of who this man was, what he was like, and be able to bring it forward into a modern day setting. So it was very interesting, very exciting to have that opportunity. So although Sackville was well known and passionate about art, women and cricket, tennis, billiards, and he was very much a gambling man too, a sportsman and a gambling man. I really didn't want to change his pose because if I changed his pose, it wouldn't be a duke and he had to remain a duke and he had to remain that stalwart character that he was underneath and represent the strata of um, society that, that he belonged to. Creating the image in digital form enabled me to do a tongue-in-cheek image in pop art start, style so that um, he comes across as a real character and people will be able to connect as viewers in, in the modern day. Um, I think Reynolds might have approved and I definitely feel that Sackville would have enjoyed it too.